everyone, Alexis here. Today I am doing a resin pour on a 16 by 20 piece of glass. I'm using a dark blue, turquoise, and white. And I mixed in some bath bomb mica pigment powders into each color. I love the way the bath bomb pigments really make the resin sparkle. There's a little video at the end showing that. And other pictures um, showing it after it's framed and also outside in the sunlight. I love the way this piece turned out. I always say this, but I don't think that pictures and videos can do resin pours justice like seeing them in real life can. They're just so much better in real life. I'm using Promarine resin for this pour. It's a one-to-one -one resin, and I also have some latex gloves, and the 91% alcohol you see here goes onto the rag which helps to keep my hands and my tools clean. I don't actually put that into any of my paint. I really wanted this piece to have an ocean theme to it. I'm doing the Strawberry Swing Show at the end of this month, and I really want to have an ocean collection for it. So this is the beginning of it. Let me know what you guys think of the piece in the comments. Make sure to check out the pictures and the videos. They're really great. I'm super in love with it, and I would love to know what you guys think. I really think that using mica powders helps to create beautiful cells, lacing, and other cool effects. Especially the bath bombs, they have worked really well for me. This piece has some beautiful effects. There are close-ups and the video at the end. I was very happy with the way that it turned out. And um, tip for you guys, always make sure to mix up more resin than you think you're going to need. Because I did not. I had to stop in the middle of the piece to make more resin. And um, I was scared that it was going to set up on me. Luckily, I was quick and it did not set up. You can always use extra resin to pour on coasters or into molds if you have them. So I, as you can see my coasters in the corner there, I was going to pour on those if I had extra, but I did not. I used it all for the piece, which I'm happy with. It turned out wonderful. If you guys like the art and you like the video, please give me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. If you would like to see more of my art or better pictures of art that I have done, you can always check me out on my Instagram and on my Facebook. They will be linked in the description below along with all the materials that I have used today and links to some of them that you can buy from my Amazon affiliate link. And also my Instagram and Facebook will be on the last slide of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, have a great day, guys.